Welcome to sunny Winter Haven, Florida. I'm Lane Dog Bowers, and I want you to realize that you are greatly blessed, highly favored, and deeply loved. Quick encouragement for you tonight. You know, I was thinking that uh, here's the verse I wanted to share with you. In everything, give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. You know, if you think about it, this is a huge advantage we have. You know, as a businessman, as a father, in everything you do, one of the best ways to practice the presence of Jesus is to actually acknowledge Him. It says in the Bible, in all your ways acknowledge Him and He will direct your paths. What's a good way to do that? For me personally, I think the best way to do it is just to say thank you. Thank you. And if you're not sure what, you know, almost anything you can see. Thank you for this beautiful, nice, calm night. Thank you, Jesus, that I got to spend time with my family and hang out with them today. Thank you, Jesus, for those orders that came in while I'm sleeping. Thank you, Jesus, for blessing my life. And you know what? There's no end to what you can thank Jesus for because every good thing comes from God. And you know, if you practice Jesus' presence, He sees your faith and He, and he will run show himself strong. You know, if you think about it, Jesus set the perfect example. You know, when he walked up into Lack, you know, and there were all these people to feed, 5,000 men, not including children, women, you know, what's the first thing he did? He took the little he had, he thanked the Father, and it miraculously multiplied. You know, when Jesus was in Peter's boat, a great load of fish afterwards came to Peter, even though he was an expert in his field, even though he knew way more about fishing, he thought, than Jesus. Look at what came his way by involving Jesus in his business. You know, to the rest of the world, this is foolishness. You know, there's just like, give me a technique, give me some traffic tips. Those are easy. If you want to grow your business, or if you want to get started in a Christian online business, I can show you how to do that. But really, the foundation of this whole thing is the fact and I, I'm looking for more people who believe that like I do, is the principal thing is the most important. Involve Jesus in everything you do and watch what happens to your business. Don't look at me as an example. Look at God's Word. Stand on it. And today, just I encourage you, look for a reason to give thanks. If you're upset, if you're depressed, something horrible happened, I'll give you an example. It's kind of funny. I wasn't going to share this. But my wife got pretty upset with me today because in the mail comes a ticket I didn't even know I had. And apparently I ran a red light. You know, since I've had kids and gotten married, I've calmed down a lot. So I really didn't think I had run a red light. But you know what? I went ahead and I just paid it and went on with it. And I was pretty upset at the moment. But then I started laughing about it. You know, what's, what could I possibly give thanks for as I'm writing a check for this ticket? Well... You know what, Lord, I'm thankful that I didn't have to stop, get pulled over by a police car, get embarrassed as people have to see that I'm getting a ticket, and I didn't have to think of an excuse, of why, which I normally don't anyway if I do get a ticket. But you know what, even in the midst of something bad like that, I found a way to be thankful. Was I happy about it? Absolutely not. But you know what, as much as it hurt, I thought of a reason I was thankful. I encourage you, I want you to receive a blessing as you see this video. Get encouraged. The Lord is with you. Just imagine if people could actually see Jesus with you. What would you do? I mean, just think of what you do if people actually saw him. I mean, your whole life would change. Well, the truth is, he is with you. And it's activating your faith by thanking you in every situation, even when you don't feel like he's with you. God bless you tonight. I'm expecting a miracle for you. Have a great evening.